Well, we have tested a, a full-size foil from the 2013 America's Cup, so we understood better how that performed and matched that against our analysis predictions. But then we've looked at other parts of the foil, specific uh, coupon tests up to subscale structures as well. So it's a whole lot of different tests we've performed to help Oracle Team USA. In Airbus, we have three main structural test centers around Europe. Um, we have the ability to test full-size aircraft, and we've managed to use some of that capability to test a full-size America's Cup foil. We also have analytical means where we can model and simulate how that will perform uh, by prediction, and then we can match those two things together to get a best engineering understanding. We are looking at several things, particularly rupture is interesting, how far you can push the foil before it fails, but then we also want to understand exactly how it fails so that we can design it to be higher performing. One of the great things about breaking a dagger board or a component is that you, until you've done that, you never know what your margin of safety is. You have calculations, uh, many, many calculations that rely upon the margin of safety, but you never guarantee it or, or know it with certainty until the breakage is made. And you learn a huge amount by breaking the dagger board. Within well, the facilities that we have, we can't do structural tests and inspections like we can do in a facility that Airbus have here. So one, we inspect the part before it's damaged, we then take it to failure, and then we inspect the failure uh, and understand the failure mechanism. The benefits for Oracle Team USA is they can accurately predict how their foil will perform. They can, with that understanding, they can push the performance even higher so that you can imagine that they can now design a higher performing foil than they had in the past.